So what's going on guys? I woke up today. If you don't know me, I'm Fatman by the way, and click that subscribe button and like button because it helps me and it helps the algorithm a lot. So I woke up today and I opened Valorant and you know what I fucking saw? Something I was pissed off about. Um, you know, I prepared my credit card to buy a few Valorant skins, you know, to um, or donate it to some Twitch eTots. But what I tried to do is go to the store and I wanted to look at the prices, right? And I thought, oh, okay, this is pretty fair prices, like 1.75 cents for a skin. Oh, CSGO also has such cheap skins, why shouldn't I buy that? Um, well, to curb your enthusiasm, look at this. I tried to purchase this, right? Um, they give me a, they give me <laughs> what? What? Uh, and then I click, and then I, and I try to buy it, right? Um, and this, this is not $9. This full set is not $9. They're giving me a $25 discount. And $90? Like, you know what I could do with fucking $90? I could legit buy myself so many things. For, for stars, an average wage here is 1,000 euros, right? So let me see here. Let's, let's just look at the prices. This is also the devs reacted to it. So watch until the end, right? I will, at the, at the end, exp I explain how, what the devs were basically thinking. Uh, I have to load this page, like, it's doing so bad, but $90, I can buy, like, 9 lunches for here, so the average wage is, like, 1,000 euros here, it's it's not even loading up for me, but that, that's, like, it, it's, it's such bullshit, like, are you kidding me? Their store isn't even working, and that's a huge issue, I'm gonna explain it in, in, in Valorant, like, holy shit, this is, this is an actual issue that... A lot of people don't realize um, and I wanted to talk about it in this video and this prison collection is too fucking expensive look at this just for one skin it's gonna not even cost you $10 after you buy this skin um, it's gonna be actually have to invest at least $20 first on the site um, you know this is basically free in the bundle like I don't want a free knife like I would just buy a knife but not for you have to put in $50 if because you know they, they don't put it for $25 so you can basically put $25 and that's it right it's $25 and 50 cents I'd say I mean sorry 25 yeah $25 and 50 cents so you have to put in $50 from your credit or whatever um, to actually unlock the knife and I think that's huge bullshit these, these things even, even aren't tradable for, for example a CSGO knife is like a pretty good one that's like a medium tier knife um, it's $100 right um, and those are actually sellable on the steam market or basically on the internet um, and this is what I have find huge bullshit okay you can buy this for like ten dollars right but at what point are you gonna play spectra for more than like four or five rounds um this pisses me off like okay you can have a knife but if you check here um they're getting some free skins but none of them are actually real guns so let me go here um for example let's say let's look at the classic right you have the um, race classic, Sage classic. Okay, I like that. Imperium. Cla okay, I don't think an Imperium. Um, yeah, we have race classic and Sage classic, right? And now we have some other guns that are actually free. They aren't as good looking as the ones in the store. Um, but what I'm really pissed off is there are no free knives here. Um, this is for. This is paid. This is paid. This is paid. No, River is not paid. Um, this is paid everything everything since here is paid and, and that's a huge fucking bullshit okay um and why would i pay 90 dollars for a game that's free like holy shit and i know what you're saying fat man just don't don't do it don't do it if you don't like if you like the game buy the skins well i don't want to buy the skin um for like i don't know 90 dollars are you kidding me like okay it's because it's closed beta it's 64 dollars right now but this is this is outrageous this is actual bullshit um and what i think by this is let's let's look at here i think i think it's somewhere right right here right in the collection um there's no preview available for this shit um actually i think it's it's like here look this look pretty nice right but would you say you would rather buy this than a $20 game? Like, you're gonna legit get Witcher 3 for that price. 
Um, like, holy shit, this is expensive. I don't know what these levels mean yet. Um, but I think you have to, like, upgrade them and choose different skin colors, I guess. Um, this looks, this looks alright. Now, if we look at Prism, it's not, the, the shop half of the time is not even working, so it must be a miracle that it's working. And I, I'm pretty pissed off. And you know what the dev said? The price is not yet set in stone. And I totally agree with them. Like, <laughs> Are you kidding me? The price is not set in stone. They shouldn't have set these high prices. And what I'm trying to do, uh, what I think they're trying to do, um, is basically milk the the money right now. Because in CSGO, people are spending a lot of these dragon lures, right? So they're basically trying to milk people right now. That's how they responded. This is a closed beta, so the prices aren't set in stone, right? Um, and they're basically trying to somehow milk these people to you know, spend more money in the game. Uh, because CSGO was hugely popular, but they're making a huge issue by not making these items sellable back. Or they're making also a huge issue that instead of putting like six exact amount, you have to put triple amounts. And this pisses me off. Um, I woke up, so I'm gonna get my coffee or whatever. And you'll be sure to check out my other videos. This is gonna be a shorter video. And this is Fagan, sign out. Peace, guys.